It's a practice we've seen throughout the coronavirus pandemic, drive through parades. They are celebrations, even church services, but Valley Health officials say they are not safe and they should stop. Our Kirsten Mitchell live in Fresno with the reasoning behind that, Kirsten. Well, Stephanie, a big part of it is the amount of people inside the car during these events. As you can see, I'm alone in here, which is safe, but health officials say that's rarely the case. It's heartwarming moments like this <laughs> that have given a sense of togetherness in a time apart. We're hoping people will see the idea behind them and not want to put other people at risk. But Madera and Fresno County health officials are pumping the brakes on drive through celebrations, including teacher parades where social distancing rules can easily be broken. We've heard reports of his kids from multiple families getting together to sort of watch the parade or see the teacher all together. And then suddenly you've got kids from, you know, six different households all combined. Not just outside, but inside cars too, as people choose to carpool when parking is limited. It's such a closed space to be in whenever you're driving in a car together with other people. Um, and we just didn't feel like it was worth the risk. As we all know, the foolproof way to celebrate safely is virtually. Using popular apps like Zoom, Skype, or FaceTime. Well, we Drive-through or parking lot worship services also a no-go, according to Madera Health Officer Dr. Simon Paul. Events where people congregate in their cars, I think, are a bigger problem than the parades, actually, because that's where you get people from multiple households combining in one car because they all want to attend, uh, especially if parking is limited. Health officials hope people heed their warnings and realize the sooner we separate, the faster we can be together. And I hate to be the one to actually rain on the parade here tonight, but uh, you know, so many people, they saw this as a way to really safely connect with people from a distance. But as you just heard from health officials, they say it's just really not worth the risk. Reporting live in Fresno, Kirsten Mitchell, KC24, local news that matters.